Buzz and Evo it's your girl April so this video is gonna be super quick because it's an easy wig that I created using hair which is from a company called Delago Delago you guys know I will chop up any name so we just gonna get past that they did send me three bundles of their kinky curly hair and a closure it was 14 14 12 and the 12 inch closure but being that it's kinky curly hair I only needed to use two so I went ahead and I did color it somewhat just using um, I think it was like just regular hair dye I just used regular hair dye to get this colored look on it and it's very very kinky and very very curly so the curls are really tightly curled like you guys see here and when I dried it I just put it on my mannequin head and I put some of the eco styler gel in it along with some conditioner and just like hair cream create this unit on a deluxe wig cap which does come with just the adjustable straps in the back and the rest of the cap is netted and there's only two combs in the back area and then there's the elastic band in the front because you guys know I don't want to wear any combs like by my hairline because I'm trying to grow my edges back so the first thing I want to do is go ahead and just cut this closure piece off now I'm not really sure how I'm going to wear this style but I did brush it down in the front in a bang so that way you know it'll look at least somewhat like how I want it to look okay ladies so let's try this again because you guys already know from my video the other day which was a synthetic lace front that was very very similar to this one which was game changer you guys know I did not pull that off and no means at all um yeah so we're gonna give this a try hopefully I don't end up looking like Rachel again um <laughs> But yeah, so the name of the company, I hope I pronounced it correct. I think it's pronounced Dulago, okay? That is an AliExpress vendor. You guys know you can get a lot of great hair from AliExpress. You just have to take the time to look for the proper vendor. Check the reviews, check YouTube, you know what I'm saying? You have to just make sure and take your time when purchasing hair from AliExpress. But I actually do like AliExpress um, because it's just a lot cheaper, you know, but it is very time consuming. So I decided to put some mousse in this hair, you know, my favorite. Favorite Dollar Tree mousse because messing with the eco styler and watching videos upon videos on YouTube on of natural girls who use the eco style or who have used because they don't anymore a lot of them um on their natural curly hair I thought it would be great for the unit especially because it's naturally curly um I was very disappointed with the eco styler because it was um, kind of hardening in the actual hair it didn't allow the curls to move so in order for me to loosen these curls I definitely had to use some of my mousse so I went ahead and basically almost saturated the hair down with it it gave the hair a lot of movement but the main thing was it gave it a lot of softness and that was the issue that I was having now the one thing that I wish really really occurred was that the dye job just showed up a whole lot more on camera because in person you can see it really well but it's just a lot of hair and it will consume you like seriously all this hair can swallow a person up so you know I, I would like to try styles like this I really would but sometimes you know it doesn't go for me um, and I, it just has to have like a certain height and a certain volume in order for me to be able to you know rock it now how I dyed the hair was, you know me, the Ordinary Easy, which was the Dark and Lovely box dye. I think I used Dark and Lovely or, um, geez, I can't really remember, but and I know it was a, um, it was a box dye, um, and I'll definitely have to link it below. But I think it was either Dark or Love, Dark and Lovely or Cream of Nature. Those are the two main ones that I use. Um, but overall, the experience with this was, you know, different. It did take me a minute to style it. Okay, I did cut it in an angle in the front because it needed that, you know, layered look. You know, um, I just don't like it to be all choppy in one length. But it was different, and um, yeah, if I would rock natural curly hair like this all the time of course not this is a lot of maintenance and you know this is just a lot of work but I did have fun creating the unit and I did have fun styling it because it was just something that I made so I'll definitely link all of their information below for you guys and I hope you enjoyed this video and I think this one came out a lot better than the one from yesterday okay you guys so 
this did take me some minutes okay like it took me some minutes to style this one because but for me if it is big it definitely has to be big and fluffy all over you know what i mean big like all over so i definitely had to just kind of like put some volume into this unit um especially on the top just kind of like finger comb it upwards now i will tell you this using the eco styler gel because i've had this gel for like a minute um and i just use it for my edges sometimes i didn't like the way it made the hair feel it kind of made it hard and the reason why I put it in is because I just seen like all the natural young ladies who used it they used it in their hair they said it defined their curls but it seems like that it just makes the curls harder okay it just makes the curls very hard and stuck together and I need some movement like I wanted to be able to move and so I definitely had to use like one of my favorite mousses in the whole world for a dollar which is the salon selectives that just freed all the extra hardness and it was it able it enabled me to just be able to just like maneuver through the wig other than that like the only downfall I don't really see like the color like you can see it but you can't see it as much as I expected to see it like when I'm looking at it versus wearing it I can see it a lot but just like on camera you can only see it a little bit and I guess it's just because of all the curls it's a lot of hair it's a lot of hair like I said it's two bundles like and I actually sold the tracks further apart because I knew the hair was going to get really really big and for kinky curly hair you do not need a lot of hair at all now the quality of the hair when I did brush it after I conditioned it you know it does soak up water so I definitely had to use like a lot of conditioner I used my dub and I just kept brushing it really through the hair so that way that I made sure to get all the strands and it did shed just a tiny bit which was great you know I did bleach the closure on it but you know it really didn't matter because you're not going to see the part anyway in this and I did cut some of it off camera which was just these two chunks in the front of which was the closure just to kind of give it like an angle and so it just doesn't you know just lay there and it's not droopy but for the most part the quality is good the length of it is decent because I don't want it too long when it gets too long it seems like it'll probably tangle up and mat up um, the softness of it once you take out the eco styler or just don't use the eco styler it makes a huge difference in the hair so it is actually a lot more softer now and I do like it a lot better without the eco styler gel in it because it just allows the wig to be able to move a lot better instead of it being kind of like stuck in one place now is kinky curly my favorite type of hairstyle it isn't I prefer the kinky straight but the good thing about this one is you can definitely put a flat iron to it now don't ask me how long it's going to take to straighten it I'm not really sure but you could definitely put heat to this you know what I'm saying and it will get straighter um, it just may take a while I would say either wear it or as you flat iron it or if you have a hot comb I would do that or if you actually have a manicure can have to prop it on and then go ahead and flat iron it or hot comb it then that would make a world of difference it would just save up a lot of time so you guys you can let me know what you think about this unit here this is like the second kinky curly unit I have ever made so on that note I'll leave all the information the links for this hair this link the links for God I'm going to try to pronounce this one more time Diaglo Duaglo uh, whatever it is you know what I'm saying I do apologize if I chopped your name up but the hair quality is great the prices are super affordable and they do sell other type of hair textures as well so I'll leave all of the links down below for you guys so that way you can check it out and let me know what you think of this hairstyle do you think I can rock big curly hair or not you know what I'm saying is it a hit or a miss for me either way I'm glad that I didn't have to bring out any of my edges for this because a girl is trying to save them and let them grow back but I love you guys stay deep and deep delicious make sure you rate comment subscribe thumbs this video up let me know what you think and share this with all your social media friends and family and i'll see you guys on the next video